to the beach and then we had to take our Levi jeans off and, and there we were in little speedo trunks and white matchstick legs and we'd have to walk, walk that walk to the water and we'd hit it and it would be like walking into acid and it was grey and it was blue and it was like the song and we knew what the song was but we knew it was spelled with a double M and there we were in the water there was like Chris Packett Smith, Chris Packett's floating past and lollipop sticks with what's, what's, what's hairy and green and, and goes up and a gooseberry and a lift and we didn't understand it at all, it was just a fucking puzzle and everything smelt of uh, B.O. and we didn't know what B.O. was and it was Bo, what the fuck's Bo? And is it Bo? What is it? Some kind of word I don't fucking know. This is back in the day before hip-hop. We were struggling. It was Scarborough. It was the West, the Northwest, the Northeast. Fuck knows, I'm from geography. And there we were, standing there, burning in the water. Our ankles burning in the water. All we wanted to do was to put socks on, heavy socks on, and just, just dip chips in gravy in a small cafe. Just chips and gravy, that's all we wanted. We didn't need salt, just chips and gravy. Now all he does is laugh. i 
see Even likes me new CD So tell him, there's a lot of CDs in the back of the t-shirts t- 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 He doesn't understand the mechanics of CDs It's not spelled S-W-E-D-Y, it's C-D And he's still there's no point trying to explain to me father who shoveled concrete for 25 years and who reads his newspaper headlines aloud ad nauseum. 16 Kenyan babies found on an island of Guernsey. <laughs> Dad, I'll read it for you, it's all right, I'll read it for you. <laughs> Okay, I'm, I'm turning into dad. <laughs> I'm turning into dad. I'm turning into my old man. Oof. <laughs>
the sky, I see the stars, and they make me want to cry. I look up and I see the light, it's shining down, it's cold and light, and little snowballs hanging in the sky, that make me cry, and I'm falling for the stars, I'm falling for the stars. And it 
you think I'm talking a load of rubbish? Maybe I don't care. <laughs> A little bit of it is when you buy some jeans from the local store with three three twigs. So I got a six pack here, I got a bill, I got a bus, I got the sketches, okay? If you think I'm talking a load of rubbish. <laughs>
the story, so I'm going to keep it short. All right. Me and Ben and Johnny, well, a little while ago, we did our, maybe our first big gig in London. I think it was here, maybe. We were driving down to London. We were like children. We were frightened. We were happy. We were like rubbing each other. I was rubbing Ben's back. I'm sitting in the back and I'm rubbing his back because I'm so I can't contain myself. I'm coming down to Stoke Newington. I'm going to drive down and I might see some EastEnders. I might see, I might see Paul Nicholas. I might see somebody who plays Freddie Mercury in one of the shows or somebody from like Miserables. I'm coming down and there's all these big theatres and the streets are paved with gold and there's people walking around with long cigarettes and, and there's, there's Jewish people and Irish people dancing together like it's heaven. I have no idea at all. This is not like Leeds. I'm driving down and I'm thinking this is what I'm going to see. It's going to be magic. It's going to be paradise. It's going to be cool. There'll be people with moustaches. People with tiny, tiny ankles. The tiny turnips on it, all with long pointy toes. Oh, it'll be like a fairy tale, like Rip Van Winkle and Rumpel Stilskin. We're driving along the way, and there's a fucking leaf trap behind the windscreen wiper. All the way from Leeds, it's hanging on. It. We're doing 70, it's hanging on. We get to Leicester, it's hanging on. It's unbelievable, it's hanging on. And we're thinking about the gig, and there's a leaf there, and it's magic, it's a miracle. And we get to London, we do the gig and we're just filled with fury and adrenaline and, and oh God, I don't, I can, we couldn't contain ourselves, but we couldn't, we couldn't articulate our feelings because we were so excited and we just went, oh gosh, and then we got back in the car and we drove back towards Leeds and the leaf's there, the little leaf's there and it's hanging up and we're thinking, what's this, what does it mean? Brian Cox, what does it mean? What does it mean? Gypsy Rose Lee, what does it fucking mean? And we get back, we're doing Leicester Barnes like Sheffield, and it hung up, and it hung up. And somewhere around Wakefield, it disappeared. And we were just mad. It was such an extraordinary journey that I fucking wrote a song about it. And here it is. 56 and I'm sketching it. Guide us on our way, sweetly 
It's getting better. Now, now we know we're talking. Thank you very much for coming out tonight, and we're just going to carry on until uh, people have to go to work. Those of, you, those of you that have jobs, those of you that have those golden gilded things jobs, £7.50 an hour, coming out now to buy a pint of beer at the weekend and a packet of crisps and ketchup. Hey. <laughs> Adriano Triscoll, old Triscoll, old Triscoll, Adriano Triscoll, that's a fine old Irish name. She's got a lot of brothers called Porrick, called Porrick, Porrick. She's got a lot of brothers called Porrick, and a sister who's called Jane. <laughs> Her hair falls down, all down her back, falls down her back, all down her back. She's proud of her hair and it's nearly all black and she's 44 years old. Adriano Triscoll, old Triscoll, old Triscoll. Adriano Triscoll, that's a fine old Irish name. <laughs> There's a dog in the corner and a log on the fire, a log on the fire, a log on the fire. A dog in the corner quite close to the fire and the smell of burning hair. Adriano Triscoll, oh Triscoll, oh Triscoll. Adriano Triscoll, that's a fine old Irish name. She lives in a house with a mother and a dad, a mother and a dad and a husband down. She lives in a house with a mother and a dad and she's 44 years old. Adriano Triscoll, oh Triscoll, oh Triscoll. Adriano Triscoll, that's a fine old Irish name. Got a picture in a purse of a handsome man, a handsome man, of a husband down. He's small, he's bald, and he drives a van, and he's 46 years old. Adriano Driscoll, oh Driscoll, oh Driscoll. Adriano Driscoll, that's a fine old Irish name. She's got a big white face and cherry red lips, cherry red lips, cherry red lips, her teeth are yellow and she's wide in the hips and she's 44 years old. She once was a dancer but she could have been a mum, she once was a mum and had a baby in her tongue but the child didn't last past the age of one, now she doesn't have to spoil that dog. Mary McCall is a regular caller, tall and down but small than Adriana. She often arrives in a flood of tears, because she's lost all her wages on the bingo. <laughs> Adriano Driscoll, oh Driscoll, oh Driscoll. Adriano Driscoll, she's just about doing okay. Thank you. Silver Edmund in a box 
string vest with a big gold chain, wearing shades, a big cigar, and a glamorous lady. I went over to him, I said, hello, Jim. And I shook his hand. This is a different legend, Jimmy Savile, from my album. He was going to fix it for me. Jimmy Savile, he had my album. He was gonna fix it for me, that's his thing, and now it's down to me. He let me down, Jim. He let me fucking down, boy. Johnny Cash. Johnny Cash, the man in black. Six foot eight. Big, big man. Big tall man. A big lead man, he was a country star. A big, big man. C W, Country and Western. Cracking women. Leather, very 
down with a ass like back and big, big sunken eyes. Selling your carpets. Selling. 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 They're looking at you. They've got these long eyelashes. And they're looking at you. Bob. Bob. Bob, sell me some carpet. Bob.